I think the Tories in Westminster have got a big question to ask themselves because every day they allow Boris Johnson to remain in office right now, uh, they become complicit in all uh, of the, the wrongdoing uh, that he stands accused of. I think after the last, you know, 24, 48 hours, I think it starts to feel that it is now a matter of when, not if, Boris Johnson is uh, forced out as Prime Minister. I think that's what the vast majority of people of the country want to see. For me, for the SNP, for Scotland, I think there is a more fundamental question. No matter how unfit he is for office, and I think he is unfit for office, uh, the Tory policies, the worldview that is driving those will remain after him. And for Scotland, the question is, do we want to continue to be governed by Tories at Westminster that we don't vote for, imposing policies that are doing real damage to communities across our country? Yesterday felt to me like quite a significant turning point. Uh, he will try to cling on, there is no doubt about it. He will try to wriggle off the, the hook or the multiple hooks that I think he is on. He clearly has no shame. He clearly has no respect for Parliament, for democracy, for the institutions that our democracy depends on. So Boris Johnson will continue to put his own interests ahead of the interests of his party and, more importantly, ahead of the interests of the country. But I think uh, time is running out for him um, and we'll see what happens. But it feels to me that events yesterday uh, turned this into a question of when, not if.